people and you can go out because people are out of an apple. Let's just get out there. Good morning! You wake up empty. What? We're here at San Jose. We got here yesterday. We've got an Airbnb. It's really nice. It's actually right in the heart of San Jose University. Okay, let me open this for you guys. How do I open this? No! No! Yay! How you guys could go people watch? We have NPR on. Daddy's gonna be on live! That's their face when they know there's yogurt for breakfast. Good morning, Sacramento. Ohio oh, Kazai boss. We came here last night because I'm gonna be on NPR, National Public Radio. Baby careful. Good morning. We're discussing uh man buns. Pre man buns? Free man buns. The awkward stage be before <laughs> you reach it. I'm also working on it, as you can tell. <laughs> Wednesday, 6 p.m. Yes. On Facebook, you can go to our pages. We'll have all the links live yeah. for an hour. It's gonna be I will be dope. painting, performing live. And I'm gonna put you to work. You're also gonna paint. All right. Yeah. Looking forward to it. We're whispering. We're whispering. We're whispering. We're whispering because of this intimidating red light. It's a fundraising effort started by two YouTube stars, Benji and Judy Childs. In 2016, yes. the couple raised more than five hundred and eleven thousand dollars to help feed children and families <laughs> around the world through Convoy of Hope. This year, the goal is one million. And one of Sacramento's best-known performance painters is is helping. So today on Insight, we have a date. David Garibaldi and Benji Travis joining us in okay. studio. We have a twenty-four hour live broadcast. And we're basically getting people to help us feed these hungry kids that are all over the globe. I will be doing two paintings in that time. And uh, also I think we're going to do some giveaways just mm -hmm. for fun. But, uh, you know, my paintings are done very quickly. Mm -hmm. You know, six foot paintings and minutes to music. But I think I might throw some dance moves in there too. You know, yeah. just get in on the dance fun. He's so good on the spot. I'm like, yay, hey, good job. If I were there, I'd be like, um, uh, uh, let's call daddy. Hey, babe. Hey, good job. Great job on the radio. Did you listen to the whole thing? You yeah, we did. Sleep. Mia's upset that she can't see her face right now. Oh, no. There you go. Oh. <laughs> hi. Say hi, How's Daddy. Daddy! Good job, Daddy. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Nobody knows how to turn on the shower head. Yeah. Okay, is it not this? Not that. Oh no. Yes, girl! Oh, wow. <laughs> My first time trying Bill's coffee. This is probably one of the best coffees I've ever had. Even better than the Starbucks dark roast and the Kirkland dark roast, which I really like. Oh. Coffee break. I was driving, but then I got sleepy. Started talking about Start, money rabbits. Started hallucinating. Also, we met Karen! Hello. Karen, I asked uh, if she supports Stan Samper, and then BAM! She showed me the sticker. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, I'm like starstruck right now. <laughs> I'm like studying for finals, and then I see Benji and Chris come in, and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is the motivation I need. Yeah. yeah. Go yeah. down, Samper! Yes, go Karen. Good luck on your uh, your finals, and thank you so much for supporting Convoy Home. So we're at a place called Pyology. These are fresh pizzas. I'm here with Auntie Val, or sorry, I'm here with Val. <laughs> and what'd you get on yours? I got pepperoni, mushrooms, garlic, and artichoke. Oh my gosh, look how much garlic they put. That's gonna be so good. And then I got like a zesty artichoke, and I got a side salad. This is gonna be delicious. It's gonna start in under an hour. The girls are supposed to be napping. I don't think it's happening. In fact, I hear one of them coming down the stairs. I love it. I love it. I, I'm gonna... Where's I... Kia? Is Kira sleeping? Yeah. Come on, let's go pee pee. <laughs> <laughs> so no nap, huh? Because we gotta go anyways. Who needs naps when you could just eat pizza, right? No. You know what I'm saying? No, no, the baby. Benji, go open some doors. You ready? Ready! You ready, Stacy? Yeah. Are you ready? Being ready. Are you ready? Are you ready? Get in here, big boy. Are you guys ready? 
All right, 10 more minutes. I'm just, I'm kidding, just kidding. It's Jimmy time, meet and greet, San Jose. Let's go. Hello? Three minutes before we got here, both the kids knocked out in the car. They might be sleeping with us up there. The big, sour. Sour. The big ones are sour? Oh, maybe it's not a good batch. Okay. Yeah. Oh, the giant ones are not sour, but the big ones are. <laughs> what? What? Where? <laughs> I will later. Soon, we're we're gonna go out there, okay? No, I think people when you can go out because people are gonna never. Let's just get out there. Dance summer means everything to me. Like seeing that 100% of our proceeds get to go to the kids all around the world, and knowing that all of it goes to kids is really. It's that hard. You know, what Dance Samba means to us is pretty cool, it's pretty awesome. Uh, I like the fact that, you know, they're giving back to the community with all the success that they have. You know, where we live in America, we often take what we have for granted, like the basic things like water and like food. And so just to be able to follow Benji and Judy in their success with Dance Samba, it's really humbling. So I've been watching Dance Samba since honestly almost like the first or second one. So I mean, I've been to the Philippines and I've seen like child like hunger, I've seen all that stuff. So to donate, like honestly to donate has been like a really big part of like, it's like a big deal to me because I want to give back to the community more than just like, just keep taking and taking. So Dance Summer means uh, being able to contribute, not just locally, but you know, throughout the entire world, helping kids who are hungry, and you know, we're gonna raise that million dollars this year. Dance Summer is such a charitable cause, and we're so blessed to even be a part of it, and we thank everyone who's also donating, and I believe in good karma, so if you do good, you're gonna get good, but it's really better to just do good. Hashtag Dance Summer! Hashtag Dance Summer! is just right behind this wall here and I can hear everyone I want to go out and say hi but I guess we're waiting for a few more people to get here uh, but we're so excited are you excited no no I not, am oh this girl is but we've been snacky we eating Jollibee the girls love the fried chicken and we got some spaghetti oh my god the Jollibee spaghetti is favorite but we've been snacking here so thank you auntie girly and angelica for hooking it up with the jolly bee i'm like getting a little nervous because i don't know when i get to get out there but i'm so excited i'm so excited to meet everybody
to our Airbnb. Did you guys have fun at the meetup? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So this meetup was really good too. I felt like the Dance Upper meetups get better Call and better. Me. Thank you to everyone that came out and like hearing some of your stories. It really, it literally brought me to tears. It was so heartwarming. Mommy, you said you're not gonna cross. I know, but sometimes I cry. Why does mommy cry sometimes? I told you why. Because you're happy. Mm-hmm. I'm filled with joy. How was it? So happy. Thank you guys for everything, all the love and the support. And now I'm ready for Uber Eats. Not I'm sponsored. surprised you're not like passed out. You've been up since. I know. Six or something? It's like a slumber party, yay! No. Well, guess what? Sleepovers doesn't entail tents. It just means that uh, people are sleeping over and sometimes people sleep over on the floor. When mommy was your age, I would sleep in the closet every time we were traveling. Yeah, mm-hmm. So you guys are lucky. You get a big, big, big room with lots of space. Did you know the the baby do, did I sleep in the closet? Actually, yeah, we put your pack and play in the closet if it was big enough. Good morning. Watch. Can you like get up first? But that was a big, big closet, okay? We're gonna call it night and we will see you tomorrow in Sacramento. Night, night. Night, night.